Hello guys, welcome back to another YouTube video, and today I'll be showing off my video game collection. You could see as a really tall stack of games that the camera can't even pick up. But anyways, let's get started. First, let's start off with the Wii games that I have. Here we have LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga. Here's the spine in the back. This game is two players and requires a nunchuck. Here's the game disc and the instruction manual. This is from 2007. Here we have Mario Kart Wii from 2008. Here's the spine in the back. Four Wii remotes, um, supports Wii Wheel, Nunchuck, Classic Controller, and GameCube Controller. Here's the game disc. I like to customize these cases. Here is Wii Sports Resort. This is one of the most expensive games which I have, along with Mario Kart Wii, which is right here. Here's the spine, and the back requires Wii Motion Plus. Here's the game disc, the case feels pretty weird. Here's a game which I don't have a case for, for no good reason. NASCAR Heat, um, uh, no, NASCAR Kart Racing. Alright, here's the game disc itself. I'm just gonna put this aside, like right here. Here we have Toy Story 3, Spine, and the back. I bought this off eBay. Here's the game disc, and it's from 2010. Oh, NASCAR um, uh, Kart Racing is from 2009. Here is LEGO Star Wars 3 The Clone Wars. Here's the spine, and the back. Here's the game disc, and the instruction manual by the side. This is from 2011. I'm still trying to complete the game with all safe slots 100%, and also um, it's one of my first LEGO games that I ever bought. And here's the last Wii game, Cars 2. Here's the spine, and the back. Here's the game disc itself, and here's a couple of cheat codes just in case if you actually want them. You can pause the video, 3, 2, 1, and you're done. Alright, here's my only 3DS game which I have. Well, not really. Here's Mario Kart 7. Here's the spine. And the back. I have not played this game in a long time. Liar! Here's the cartridge itself. It's on the side for reason. No good reason. Also, it's one of my first 3DS games. Alright, here's some of the Wii U games. Only two of them I have. Mario Kart 8. Here's the spine. And the back. I don't even have a game case for it. So I'm just reusing it. Here's the game disc itself. I have it digitally downloaded. Um, even though the Nintendo eShop closed. Also, here's the instruction manual. At least I got it before the eShop closed. Well, I didn't actually physically buy it off the eShop. I actually... Oh, I'm gonna download it off the eShop because I already bought some DLC. Here is LEGO Star Wars The Force Awakens. Here's the spine. And the back. To be honest, this game is not even the best out of all the other LEGO Star Wars games. Here's the game disc itself. And the instruction manual. Also, I have um, another 3DS game. It's physical. But I don't have the case itself. Here I have Super Mario Maker for the 3DS. For some reason, I cut off the um, other latch because I actually wanted to do the same little um, thing where you actually put it on a DS. But let's proceed to the Switch games, which are the final um, console, as I'm speaking. Here's Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. I have two versions of Mario Kart 8 with me. Here's the spine and the back. Here's the game cartridge itself. Super Mario Odyssey, spine, and the back. Here's the game cartridge itself. And these two are from 2017. The Force Awakens from 2016, including Super Mario Maker for the 3DS. Um, Mario Kart 8 from for the Wii U is from 2014, and Mario Kart 7 is also from 2011, like Cars 2 and LEGO Star Wars 3. Anyways, move on to 2018 with um, LEGO The Incredibles. Here's the spine. And back. This is one of the first physical Switch games that I bought. 
Here's the game cartridge itself. From 2019, we got Luigi's Mansion 3. Well, um, I don't even play this game. Well, my, um, my brothers play this. Spine, back, cartridge itself. Super Mario 3D World and Bowser's Fury. So it's a uh, two games and one cartridge. Here's a spine and the back. I beat it, Bowser's Fury, but I have to beat 3D World. Here's the cartridge itself. Alright, here's NASCAR Heat Ultimate um, uh, Edition Plus. Here's the spine and the back. This is just a re-release of NASCAR Heat 5, but for the Switch. Here's the game cartridge itself. And to the final game I have for the Switch. And it's LEGO Stars The Skywalker Saga. I pre-ordered this game, and it comes with this steelbook, but it came in the mail like late. Alright, here's the actual game case itself. Here's the spine and the back. I don't have the game cartridge inside here, but here's the like, little um, uh, flyer. I'll show you the steel book though. Here's the spine and the back. The back is just glossy and the front is matte with Han Solo. And here's the game cartridge itself. And also, um, same design as the front cover artwork. Alright, that is my entire video game collection. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe. And see you in the next video.